Mike Strzok at Bellator 54, along with lightweight champion Eddie Alvarez. Eddie, fans here disappointed you're not on the card. You had to pull out because of an injury. What happened? Uh, so we, I sustained a couple injuries. I'm not about to say it on camera, but uh, definitely, definitely enough to um, make me, you know, pull out of this card. Uh, luckily, you know, we still have something November 19th uh, at the Hard Rock Casino, MTV2. And it's free, so there's no reason to tune in. I apologize to everyone who was looking forward to this. Um, it was unfortunate, but um, it, it's it's honestly going to be the best thing for you, myself, my team, and everyone else that um, I'm 100 percent and I'm able to defend my title, you know, at at 100 percent. Right, and I'm sure Michael Chandler is also. He wants to fight the best Eddie Alvarez out there, anyhow, right? Yeah, I mean. It, Let's say I did come out, you know, tonight, and uh, you know, I had an excuse on my back. My mind wouldn't be right, and I'd be able to say, hey, you know, if he did, if he was able to overcome me tonight, I, you know, there would always be that thing, like, hey, if I wasn't injured, what could have happened? So I want, I want to be at my, at my hundred uh, percent for myself more than Michael Chandler because I could care less about him. But um, I, I just want to be a hundred percent for myself so I can perform the way I know how. Uh, Chandler does pose some some uh, problems, not maybe not for you, but for other people. Uh, how are you preparing for Michael Chandler? No, he's a definite threat, and um, I've been doing nothing but treating him like that. And a, a lot of it's uh, the reason I'm injured. I I, I, I took him uh, pretty serious, and uh, I started my camp, you know, four months out, which is not normal. And I wanted to um, I wanted to be over prepared for this fight. I wanted to put on a performance that was dominant that I can go out there and say, you know, and make a statement. And uh, that's what I'm still looking to do. And on November, on November 19th, I'm going to do that. Well, let's talk a little bit about well, one of your training partners, Frankie Edgar, had a, an amazing fight last week. Wanted to get your thoughts on how he thought, uh, on how you thought he did. There's a lot of other words and amazing. Amazing is an understatement. And that was, you know, uh, what Frankie did that night, you know, uh, it was phenomenal. Um, it, it showed what, what so much of what a fighter is and what a, what a champion is. And uh, he went out there and put it on the line. And um, he dealt with a ton of adversity in the first round and came back and showed what you do when you're a champion. And uh, I, 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 it only inspired me to move on to the 19th and say, you know, let's get after it.